Revelation 13, 17 to 18. 17. And that no one may buy or sell except one who has the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Point 18 Here is wisdom. Let him who has understanding calculate the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, his number is 666. Despite what many Americans and feel, the United States of America aren't governed by the Holy Bible, but many countries' laws are the same as God's law. Many nations and countries all have the same law but are not religious, but even so, they have what is called separation of church and state. Some Islamic nations have religious Sharia laws, but still have similar laws. Most law they have in common is murder, stealing, kidnapping, and sexual assault are all illegal, but these same laws were in the oldest recorded law in the world that is found on the code of Yuarnamo. Even if the Bible calls the Babylonian Empire evil, and the evil church in the book of Revelation is called Babylon, still it had similar laws as most countries ancient and modern. Revelation 14, 8 Then another angel followed him through the sky, shouting, Babylon is fallen, that great city is fallen, because she made all the nations of the world drink the wine of her passionate immorality. 9 Then a third angel followed them, shouting, Anyone who worships the beast and his statue, or who accepts his mark on the forehead or on the hand. Since the United States was founded for religious freedom, it created what is called blue laws which are also known as Sunday laws. The Bible says the color blue represents the Ten Commandments, and they were told to wear it, as a reminder to self to remember God's law, the color blue somehow associated together. Numbers 15, 38 Speak to the children of Israel, tell them to make tassels on the corners of their garments throughout their generations, and to put a blue thread in the tassels of the corners. 39 And you shall have the tassel, that you may look upon it, and remember all the commandments of the Lord and do them, and that you may not follow the harlotry to which your own heart and your own eyes are inclined. 40 And that you may remember, and do all my commandments, and be holy for your God. Blue's laws were created in countries like the USA mostly for religious respect, many places would not allow it to open or alcohol was not allowed to be sold. Many places where the government is not open for business, like the U.S. post office, courthouse, and many banks aren't open on Sunday. As the United States gets older many people want to be less religious, so blues laws are hardly enforced so not many people know what blue laws are or have never heard of them. When the mark of the beast goes into full effect and strict enforcement, the laws that worship God by his way will be illegal, and anyone who doesn't worship the mark of worship will be punished by prison or death. Even in the early history of America, religious people came here for religious freedoms, but if anyone was found breaking the Sabbath, he or she would be punished for all to see. Punishment in colonial days from breaking the Sabbath were harsh, heavy fines would be given, and sometimes Sabbath breakers were put into stock for a very long time, or whipped in public for all to see. Since Sunday was made the Sabbath by the Roman Catholic many years ago, the true seventh Sabbath has been forgotten. Many Christian keep it out of tradition without knowing Saturday is the real Lord's holy Sabbath day of rest. If something like global warming seems to be an issue the world wants to deal with, the blue law like no labor on Sunday, worship, or a day off is highly suggested by world powers and will be heavily enforced to try and stop climate change from getting worse. The nations of the world don't care if you go to church or worship God, Allah, Jesus, Buddha or a Jedi religion no seventh-day worship will be allowed, but if you want to worship do it on Sunday, or else you will be treated like a criminal. Many people will embrace a Sunday day off from labor, both religious and non-religious, especially when all human rights will be allowed, if you go and live by blue laws that will become government powers real laws. God bless you all, the Lord loves you and so do I, Samuel J. H. Isaiah 56 too blessed is a man who does this, and a son of the man who takes hold of it, who keeps from profaning the Sabbath, and keeps his hand from doing any evil. 3. Let not the foreigner who has joined himself to the Lord say, The Lord will certainly separate me from his people. Nor let the eunuch say, Behold, I am a dry tree. For for this is what the Lord says, To the eunuchs who keep my Sabbaths, and choose what pleases me, and hold firmly to my covenant, Five to them I will give in my house and within my walls a memorial, and a name better than that of sons and daughters, I will give them an everlasting name which will not be eliminated. Six also the foreigners who join themselves to the Lord, 
to attend to his service, and to love the name of the Lord, to be his servants, everyone who keeps the Sabbath so as not to profane it, and holds firmly to my covenant, seven even those I will bring to my holy mountain, and make them joyful in my house of prayer. Their burnt offerings and their sacrifices will be acceptable on my altar, for my house will be called a house of prayer for all the peoples.